Okay, so I'm going to be reviewing the Dream Liquid Mousse, and as you can see, I've used almost a whole bottle, so I wanted to wait a while and do a review on it. Um, I bought this. I was using a different foundation for the longest time. I was using CoverGirl's True Blend. So I was really using that for like honestly years. I was on my way somewhere and I realized I didn't have foundation for whatever. I was my friend's bachelorette I think actually and I didn't have foundation. So I needed to buy something quick and I grabbed this. It was on sale for like $6. I didn't have any expectations for it because I had tried the one in the jar before and I hated it. It was like putting on like like a mousse, like literally like a mousse you eat on your face. Like it was like gross, so I didn't like it. But this, I love, oh my god, I love this so much. It's so awesome. It goes on flawlessly. I have it on right now. Hopefully you agree <laughs> that it goes on flawlessly. Um, a range of colors. Make sure you get the Dream Liquid Mousse. The Liquid Mousse, not the actual like mousse mousse. It's great. I use it with a sponge to apply and I love it. I just put moisturizer on my face, wet my sponge a little bit, and then apply it with this. So it's awesome. I would highly recommend this. There's lots of different colors and different shades. It goes on flawlessly. It. I have very oily skin and it. I find that it gives me a matte finish, but a natural matte finish. Um, it doesn't feel heavy at all and I'm, I can be very particular because my skin is so oily and is so, um, I don't like to feel like I have a big cake of makeup on my face all the time. So I love this foundation. It's awesome. I would highly recommend it and, um, yeah, it's fairly cheap too. So good coverage. I think medium to high coverage even though it's more light. I like more of a higher coverage personally, so it definitely um, meets my standards, but yeah, it does blend in to my natural skin tone. So I would recommend this, and it's awesome. Check it out.